Spectrum routers use dual band technology, broadcasting on both 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz frequencies simultaneously. Understanding these bands is key to optimizing your network performance. Modern Spectrum routers, including the Sagemcom Fast 5260 and Technicolor models, typically combine both frequency bands under a single network name. This unified approach works well for most users, but separating the bands can provide significant advantages. These routers broadcast on two distinct frequency bands, each with unique characteristics that make them suitable for different types of devices and activities. The 2.4 GHz band operates at a lower frequency, providing excellent range and wall penetration. It can reach up to 150 feet indoors and easily passes through walls and obstacles. In contrast, the 5 GHz band operates at a higher frequency, delivering much faster speeds but with reduced range. It's ideal for high bandwidth activities like streaming and gaming. This frequency comparison shows how the 2.4 GHz band has fewer non-overlapping channels, leading to more interference, while 5 GHz offers many more channels with less congestion. By default, Spectrum routers use a single network name for both bands, automatically steering devices between them. However, separating these bands gives you manual control over device placement leading to better performance and easier troubleshooting. Smart home devices like thermostats and security cameras work well on 2.4 GHz due to their need for range over speed. Meanwhile, streaming devices, gaming consoles, and computers benefit from the high speeds of 5 GHz. Understanding these frequency bands and their characteristics is the foundation for optimizing your Spectrum router's performance. In the next section, we'll walk through the actual steps to separate these bands on your router. There are two main ways to separate your router bands, through the web interface or using the MySpectrum mobile app. We'll cover both methods step by step. For the web interface method, first connect to your router's network. Open any web browser and navigate to either 192.168.1.1 or 192.168.0.1. You'll see a login screen. Enter the username and password found on your router's label. This is usually on a sticker on the back or bottom of your router. Once logged in, navigate to the wireless or Wi-Fi settings section. Look for band settings or advanced wireless options. Disable band steering or smart connect. This feature automatically manages which band devices connect to, but we want manual control. Create unique network names for each band. For example, use mynetwork underscore 2.4G for the 2.4 GHz band and mynetwork underscore 5G for the 5 GHz band. Set identical passwords for both networks. Save your settings and wait for the router to restart. This may take a few minutes. Alternatively, you can use the MySpectrum mobile app for a simplified setup. The app provides guided steps and is often easier for less technical users. After separating the bands, connect your devices to the appropriate network. Use 5G for high-speed devices like laptops and streaming devices, and 2.4G for smart home devices and those farther from the router. 